Hello, my name is Sophia Sunaritz and I'm professor at the chemistry department of the University of Lille. Attached to the EUMN center around micro nanofabrications located at the northern part of France, Lille. Uh, our team, the Nanobiophase Intergroup, fo focuses on nanomedicine based therapeutic uh, approaches for inhibiting viral and bacterial infection, but also covers the area of diagnostics, uh, notably electrochemical, electrical, and plasmonic uh, transducers. I took the role of editor of chief of the Royal Society of Journal of Science and Diagnostics since August 2022 with the aim to push the scientific borders of this very interdisciplinary field. Uh, sensors and diagnostics exist since one and a half years and helps to highlight innovative and original work devoted to sensors, biosensors and any other diagnostic device which appear to a rapid and fast uh, detection of environmental hazards as well as of biological biomarkers or pathogens. The advent in nanotechnology, point of care testing devices, um, surface chemistry approaches, the development of novel biosensor ligands such as nanobodies and nanoclamps, uh, the growing field of uh, medical imaging as well as flow systems, all are areas which are interested for the showing of sensors and diagnostics. Let's take the example of a biosensor. So biosensors are rapid and continuous measurement devices. They're highly specific. They need uh, very little user reagents for calibrations with faster response times. They are thus ideal tools for a hospital to home solution, having uh, improved patient compilers and helping medical staff to make faster and better decisions. We are still a very young journal and huge competition is outside, especially on this very fascinating area of sensors and diagnostics. Papers of high standing and contribution from authors from very different fields will strongly influence the uh, impact of the journal and also the citations. Sensors and Diagnostic as an open access platform uh, is an universal accessible journal and doesn't need libraries or library subscription to have access to the excellent works published there. And this we will hope we can show the interest in the sensing field to a very broad international community. Myself and the editorial team believe strongly that this very rich and interdisciplinary field of uh, sensors and diagnostics will attract a large community. Uh, we believe therefore that by like taking the example of a press sensor, inhaling a large variety of journals and uh, doing our job correctly in identifying uh, the innovative and original aspects of workers, we can exhale an extremely high quality of papers in the months to come and attract your attention. So please consider the journal for being published. We are here for any help from the administrative wise as well from topics related issues. Thank you.